Well, I'm uh, Mason Dury and um, I'm Professor of Research, of Māori Research and Development at Massey University. Uh, looking ahead over the next 25 years, the New Zealand's population is going to change uh, quite dramatically and librarians will need to be ready for that. And I think there are three areas where that readiness will be particularly relevant. Uh, first of all, I think the uh, other ethnic groups, whether they're Asian, Pacific and increasingly Māori, will be looking towards libraries to provide information that is relevant to them. Uh, they will be uh, particularly interested in uh, developments in their homelands if they've come from another country, but also interested in maintaining their own cultures within New Zealand. And that will, and, unless libraries are able to demonstrate that relevance, then I think they will have bypassed uh, other ethnic groups. The second point, and it goes along with the first one, is that uh, I think libraries increasingly will need to recognise that there are other languages that need to be part of the repositories within libraries. Uh, Asian people will look for documents and look for information, uh, whether it's audio information, video or print, that will be in a language familiar to them. Uh, we would not want, I think, to have in New Zealand a group of, uh, a large diverse group who lose their own language or who lose their own culture because they've come to New Zealand. I don't think that should be a condition of coming to New Zealand. And the third point is, and it's really uh, linked to the question of empowerment, is that I think the leadership in libraries will increasingly need to reflect the mix of our population in general so that you might expect in 25 years' time that there will be leaders in libraries who are Māori, who are Pacific, or who are from Asian backgrounds, because it is those people who will act as the uh, brokers, as it were, between those communities and what libraries can provide.